You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. I'm going to check out a play a poker or play poker. This is from my bin of handheld games. This is an older one. It does require a battery and uh, I have not actually tested it. So hopefully it works. We'll see. Let me just turn it around so you can take a look at it. I was going to actually clean it a little bit because it was a little dusty. So let's just do that before we start. Yes, I have been doing more and more cleaning and prepping of toys like this on camera. Yes, look how dirty it is. It's very dirty. So you actually just pull the arm down and then you pick the cards you want to save. You're playing poker. Now let's just see in this battery compartment. Okay, so it requires one, it looks like a C battery. So let me just grab one real quick. Yeah, it looks like a C. Okay. Does it work? Okay, so right now we've got nothing. Now it could be the battery. That's not, I'm not gonna worry about it just yet. Could be the motor inside, I don't know. I didn't test the battery, so let me do that first. Sometimes I just go with the flow with my videos. Okay, that battery's terrible. That one's good. That one's good, they're both good, so it's obviously the unit. Now, could be the, the points where the battery touches. nothing. It should spin when you pull the arm. All right, I can't tell. Those security screws? I'm not sure. There's something down here. I don't know if you can press that. Let me just spin the battery around a little. Okay, just for fun. Let's try the other battery. Oh, it doesn't want to come out now. It's stuck. Oh boy. There we go. Now, you think it could be a loose wire? Let me just uh, scuff up that one terminal a little bit. That's loose. I don't hear anything on the inside. All right. I can't tell what the screws are there. There's two screws. Maybe there's just one on the inside here. No screws in there. It says 1970, made in Japan. All right, let me get some. Let me get a screwdriver set and see if we can get into that. They don't look like Phillips. They're really hard to see. All right, let me do more investigating. All right. So it almost looks like the screws are missing. Oh. That's a problem. I can't see what's holding this together. That's why I couldn't tell. Where are the screws? Where are the screws? Oh, and there's two little, ah, that's what was on the bottom there. That's to get this little cover off. There we go. Let us see. Something triggering this motor. Okay, see so the motor should spin. I'm not hearing anything, anything electrical. I 
So this is triggering, okay, there's a little spring in here which is putting resistance on this. It's repressing the buttons, but what's telling it to spin? Oh, okay, so it's something with the mechanics that's going on here. Okay, so something with this gear. Okay. So it's supposed to spin and then you stop it. And then that resets it. Okay, let me just get a little WD-40 lubricant and just hit all the key points and we'll see if it helps it. So I would never spray it right into that. Let's first hit this. Then this. And why? That one locks in. Let's see. Too bad that one. Oh, got in the gear. I was worried about that. Okay, you're free. Okay, it's definitely struggling. So it must be that this one is just cracked. A lot of times the gear is cracked. Now if I take this piece off, I'll be able to see inside this gear system here. It's working. I mean, it's spinning not great, but it's spinning. All right, screwdrivers. Take stuff apart like this, you always have to worry about breaking it. Okay. Ah, so I think this is what's sending power to all of these. Let's take this screw out. So that actually stopped all the gears from moving. This bar is crucial. I'm trying to see where this lined up. Okay, so it lined up there. All right, so let's just hold that in. So when it's a little loose, then it starts to work. All right, so, okay, I see the buttons now. The buttons are actually part of this here. This is the button. All right, let's get a little lubricant in here. I'm not sure we're gonna be able to fix it. It's old, it's used. And it's probably seen better days. Okay, so there's a gear here, a gear here, 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 and here. That's intriguing. It's got to go up a little bit more. There we go. 
Well, it's spinning better. See, when I take the pressure off, then all the wheels spin. And when you put the pressure down, okay, let me see something here. Let's take this out just a second. These come up. Okay, so those are locked in. Yeah, that whole assembly is locked in. That's not going to be an easy fix. Okay, let's do this. Let's put the screws in. But let's not tighten them as much as they were tightened, just temporary. Yes, you just kind of have to reason your way through this. And hopefully you don't make it worse. And I've done that before. I mean, you make mistakes. You don't learn unless you try things. I did a VTech video recently and I used Goo Gone on it and it scuffed up the back. But I later took some polish like a plastic polish and was able to fix it a little bit. Okay, King Six, Queen, Ace Four. Not a good hand. Oh wait, did you just see that? Hold on a second. This whole thing just lifted out. This whole mechanism. Oh, so it's attached to this arm. So you'd have to pop this arm out. Let's do this though. Now I don't remember taking it apart originally. Maybe I did in a video, I don't remember it. Okay. Would help to have the battery in. I got it somewhat playable. Five, ace, king, in the middle, two. Jack, two, nine, queen. When I press this one, it stops that one, so let's do that one first. Nine, ten, six, or five, three, three. Not a very good. A pair of threes. All right, let me move this stuff out of the way. We'll do a couple rounds. At least it's playable now. I'll be back. All right, I'm making an adjustment to the camera. Move some lights in. Let's see if this is easy to see for me now. The this one first, that's a two. That's a 10. Six, eight. That's okay. Queen, three, heart, uh, diamond heart, eight, ace, six. So it's finicky, that's for sure. It should stop. Oh, okay, that one wasn't pressed in all the way. Try it again. Spinning better. Three, ace, eight, an ace. I have a pair of aces. Ooh, not very good. So a pair of aces, that's my best hand so far. That one stopped all together. 10, ace, we can't count that ace. King, ace, three. There you go. Eight, three, three, that ace keeps stopping on the ace. Six, six, three, or five, ace, six, three sixes. Ew. Let's erase that one. Okay, now I, I hit that and it stopped that. So it's definitely, definitely finicky. Four, but what do you expect? Two, seven. That ace is really. Ooh, Joker. I got the Joker. Mesmerizing. Seven, two, 
three. Boy, it stops on that, that ace is the one that's the issue. Let me stop that one first. Six of hearts. Eight of hearts. Ace. Three. And that's a two. Okay, so it works better when I hit this one first. Seven. Three. Queen. Seven. King. Ooh. There are seven. So this one first. <laughs> Nine. Then this one. It seems to work fine. Jack. Three diamonds so far. Ooh, eight. Ace. Okay, so if I do this one first, then this one, it seems to work. Queen. Seven. Jack. Four. Ten. Oh, man, I'm just getting bad hands. Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to hit that. Two. Seven. King. Three. Jack. Ah. Uh. Ace, three, four, five, jack. Terrible hands. I'm hoping for something like a full house or a straight. Ten, eight, seven, five, joker. Ooh, wait. Five, six, seven. Oh, no, close. What's a small straight? I forgot. Two, seven, ace, two, pair of twos, four. Jack, three, seven, two, five. Oh, these are terrible hands. I want something good. Three, eight, four, king. Oh boy, I better not play any, any more games today because my luck is not in. Ace of hearts, four hearts. Queen, king, six. Ace, seven, four, queen, joker. Ten. That's a five, seven, three, four. Wow. I am very unlucky today. Nine, five, king, four, king. Pair of kings. I can't beat a pair of aces. Not even two pairs. Nine. Oh, I did out of order. Queen. Three. Eight. Ace. Oh, boy. That's a ten. A nine. A five. A six. And a queen. Boy. So on the front, it says one pair, two pair, three of a kind. Straight, flush, full house. It says full house two three, and then four cards, poker, straight flush, royal flush, and five cards. Ace, 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 and then the joker. Ace, four, five, four. Boy, that first one didn't show up. Boy, I love to get the five cards. Nine, seven, ace, three, four. I'm getting a little uh, unhappy. Not even three of a kind, four of a kind, nothing. Two, ten, queen, queen, jack. Oh, I feel like my luck is changing. Two, three, eight, three, jack. Ooh, I thought I almost had all clubs, but nope. Two, eight, four, jack, joker. Well, a pair of jacks, I guess, with the joker. Ace, six, three, two, jack. Okay, this is it. Everybody send, send good vibes through your screens. Ten, queen, four, six, five. Okay, you did your best. Two, nine, king, seven, ten. Ooh, four hearts. That two, if that was a heart. Queen, nine, king, ten, eight. That's eight, nine, ten. Nine, queen, 
three, six, eight. Jack, three, eight, two, nine. Okay, I think I'm unluckier with this machine. Jack, king, queen, six, three. Two, king, ace, eight, joker. That could be a pair of aces. And it's not stopping anymore. I think I've outplayed the machine. I'm lucky I've gotten this much. Queen, three, ace, eight, king. Nine, nine, queen, two, eight. Ten, queen, seven, eight, joker. Pair of queens. Six, that one's a nine, an eight, a three, and an eight. Pair of eights. I'm only going because I'm not... Oh, three queens. Okay, I got three of a kind. Whew, I would have lost all my money. Two, three, seven, three, three. Oh, nine. Two, ten... Three. I think that's an ace. It's hard to see. It's in the middle. Two. Five. Ace. Ace. Ten. Okay. One more. This will be it. Nine. Seven. 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 King. Oh, I could have had four of a kind if that was a joker. Would have been lucky sevens. It's like gambling. You just can't stop. You want to keep trying. Two. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Pair of twos. Right, I said that was it, so that's got to be it. Four, two, nine. All right, there you go. I got it working. I think the screw was a little too tight for the loose gear. Uh, Clean up real nice. And the little lubrication there, that helped. I got it working, which is a good thing. So this will go back now in the handheld games. And then uh, probably one of my oldest handheld games being from 1970. And it's W-A-C-O company. I think that's what it says. Let me just verify that. I got a new one of these little thingies. Let me bring it up here. And it's so dusty I can't even see through it. That's terrible. I just got it too from an estate sale. I did not clean it. I put fresh batteries in it. There we go. There we go. Can you see? I gotta look and give me more light here. Okay, W. It says made in Japan. Yeah, W A C O. Patent pending, 1970. And there's a little like earth above the W A C O. I've heard that name before on some of these older type games. Uh, I think that's it. I'm gonna let you go. I'm gonna say thanks for watching. King, King, five, Joker, three kings. Okay, there you go. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I had fun making it. Did you have this back in the 70s? Have you seen one before? Did you enjoy the video? Let me know. And thanks for watching. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.